Who's the hardest video game boss ever? Sans Undertale. This skeleton fuck is the hardest video game boss I have ever gone against. Go to the dictionary, search up hard, and you'll find this dude here with this stupid smirk. But I have a confession to make. I have never beaten Sans Undertale. Stop with your booing, I know, I know, I've kind of dropped the ball. It's been 4 years since I've gotten this game and I gave up beating him after hours of attempts. But that's about to change. I am not the same man I was before. I have gone through many plot and character developments to get to where I am today. I will finally beat Sans Undertale. Okay, so first off, I have to restart the genocide route because I lost my save file after my old laptop broke, so it looks like I'm going to have to go through this whole journey again. The thing I hated about the genocide route was how long it took to kill every single enemy. I know that's a point like, oh wow, you don't have to kill the monsters in this game, but if you do, you're gonna have to suffer the consequences. But this shit just takes too long. Let me take you through my journey of the Undertale genocide route. First we fall down, meet Flowey, meet Goat Mom, she leaves us, and now we're free to massacre her whole species. Thank god. So I get through the whole ruins, get the toy knife, go back towards the area where you get the monster candy, and I just walk back and forth until I kill enough enemies. Get the but nobody came and go see Goat Mom. Grab the pie, kill Goat Mom, I'm sorry mom, I need to, how else am I supposed to kill Sans Undertale? And leave the ruins. That's section 1 complete. Next up, Snowden, and there he is, Sans Undertale. I hope he knows I'm about to kill him. Fuck everyone, fuck Papyrus's puzzles, I'm here for one reason and one reason only, to kill Sans Undertale. Also, before I leave Snowden, I have to remember to grab some snowman pieces. It's a surprise tool that'll help us later. I get through Snowden, realize I didn't kill enough people, go back and forth on the bridge until I've gotten all of them, go kill Papyrus, section 2 complete. Now onto the waterfall. It's the same thing. Do cutscenes, kill some monsters, but we run into our first real obstacle. Undyne the fucking Undyne. This bitch gave me hella trouble the first time I played her. The only way I was able to get past her was to use all my snowman pieces and my pie. This is a big reason why I couldn't beat Sans. If I wanted even a slight chance of beating Sans, I would have to beat Undyne without using any of these items. Put all my items into a box, go find this turtle dude, and stock up on some crab apples. If I had to beat Undyne, I would need to grind out. Beating Undyne was one of the hardest things I ever had to do. I had to look at a video from someone else beating her and try to memorize where each of her arrows were coming from to even have a chance of winning. These yellow arrows and the arrows that close around you are hard as hell. I wish I recorded my reaction because after I beat her I popped off so fucking hard. 
After that pain, section 3 was finally complete. Hotland was by far the easiest section, but it did take the most time. I ended up just going through all of Hotland, going back to the conveyor belt and just walking up and down until I killed everyone. And that's section 4 complete. Section 5 was the core. I went in, got all my important items, bought a face stake and legendary hero, and I was ready to move on. You know the drill, kill the enemies, face Metaton, go through the last home area with Flowey, who cares? And then I did it. I finally got to Sands, the last corridor where our final battle will take place. I was ready. I had my pie, snowman pieces, face stake, and legendary heroes. It's time to beat Sans Undertale. All I would have to do is just beat him once and then never again. After hours of hard work and dedication, I finally made it. Fighting Sans was hard. His fight is all about trial and error. When I finally beat him, I was so happy. I fucking popped off like I never popped off before. Total time it took me to complete the genocide route was about 9 hours and 30 minutes. But then, something happened. A mistake. One simple mistake ruined this whole run. The hours of work I put into this game were for nothing. While I was fighting Sans, I paused my recording and went to the bathroom. When I got back, I forgot to unpause. So I ended up beating Sans without recording it. After the fight, when I finally won and went to go check my recording, I was devastated. I pressed record again and finished off the game. After I was done, I was left feeling empty. I beat Sans, sure, but there was no proof. I know I recorded what happened after I beat him, but it felt wrong to make the video and not include the moment I won. 
So I fell asleep. The next day I woke up with a mission. I was going to beat Sans Undertale again during one uninterrupted session. The whole game in one sitting. Let's do this. Kill everyone in the ruins. Get the pie. Murder Goat Bomb. Enter Snowden. Get Snowman Pieces. Kill Papyrus. Waterfall. Stock up on crab apples. Kill and dine again. But this time it only took me four tries. Now Hotland. This time I pick up the instant noodles because these babies heal hella HP. Grind time. Go to the core, get the face steak and legendary heroes. Metaton a bitch. And finally, back to Sans. Let's see how it went. <laughs> After four tries, I beat him again. Three hours, nine minutes. I'll have the full gameplay in the description just in case you want to see it. It's been a hell of a journey. Ups and downs, lefts and rights, but finally, after owning this game for four years, I did it. I beat Sans Undertale. My father can finally be proud of me, and I hope you are too. There's a lesson in all this. Never give up. Always try your best to succeed. And if you keep grinding out, you'll eventually get to that pop-off point where you popped off like you never popped off before. Thanks for watching. Whoa, is that subscribe stands from the YouTube AU? Whoa, is he telling you to subscribe to my channel? <laughs> well, you better do it. Thanks, Subscribe Sans. And if you like this video, make sure to like it and tell me what you thought about it in the comments. I got nothing else to say, so I guess uh, I'll see you next time. Peace out.